Hey there, this is Daniel St. Pierre with Cybergenica and Glorious Media, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to add a tab to your Facebook page and at the same time add a um, graphic, static graphic to your sidebar over here that links to that same tab. Uh, and so let's get started. Before you um, add a tab or a, uh, an app, to your Facebook page you need to work backwards and you need to create the content first so that when your friends click on your tab the content that will be displayed in this iframe over here um, is already ready to go now I've gone ahead and created a very simple form that will allow uh, my friends to download a free ebook so I'll go ahead and uh, copy the link to the actual content that I'm going to be using you need to have a secure secure page or secure web page or content and you notice the HTTPS here if you have just a standard web hosting account that's not secure that's not going to work Facebook will not allow you to use this content in a tab and because of that uh, you'll need to have an application such as Infusionsoft which is free uh, or have another source another secure source of developing a web page while you'll be placing your content. Uh, the next step involves uh, logging into developers.facebook.com and browsing to your apps. You probably will not have any. Uh, I do have a few already. So you'll click add a new app. It will prompt you to pick one of the uh, different app type. And we'll go ahead and skip that and go into basic setup. From this basic setup you will need to um, give your app an aim. Uh, in this case, we'll go with Daniel, Daniel Fast ebook. And I'll go ahead and leave that unchecked. This is not a version of another app. And we'll select category. We'll go with books. You may or may not get a captcha um, as I did here. And it's an image captcha, so you want to select all the photos that uh, feature a waterfall. Go ahead and click those. Facebook wants to make sure you're a human being, and we'll go ahead and click submit. And this should only take a few seconds. Uh, once you've done that, then your uh, app is under uh, construction or in production mode. In order to produce this app, you will need to make sure that you have under the settings tab that you have an email address. You cannot publish an, an app without a contact email. And I'll enter my email address. Go ahead and save that. We also need to make sure that we have a platform selected. And in this case, it will be page tab. Now here is where we need this secure page URL that I just copied from Infusionsoft and I'll show you what the form looks like a little bit later. We want to select a name for the tab uh, and we'll go to free fasting ebook that looks good there. We also want to add an image at this time and I'll show you where that image will be displayed. I already have an image produced, so we'll go ahead and upload that. The image restriction, one, I'm sorry, 111 by 74 pixels. So you'll notice that um, though the image is not very large, uh, it's still quite prominent on the page, and that's what's important. It should only take a few seconds to upload. And once that's uploaded, we'll go ahead and save those changes. Now the last step here in the production is to make sure that we go live with the app. So click on the app review tab, go ahead and click on yes, you'll get a pop-up, and we will confirm that we want the app to be public. Now let's get back to the settings tab. We're going to be needing this information over here and over here in the very last step of the production aspect, which is you must navigate to your app URL in order to add it to your Facebook page. You need to be making sure, of course, that you are logged into Facebook or the Facebook account that you wish to add the app to. And so here's a URL right here. It's a little tricky. Facebook.com forward slash dialogue forward slash page tab question mark. And then your app ID. You want to replace this over here with your actual app ID that you just created. So we'll go ahead and copy just that ID and go ahead and replace that in our URL here. This is your activation URL from Facebook. 
and then secondly we'll go back to the app we'll copy our secure content URL and we will that to our your secure URL here and hit enter now we navigate to the app activation page now um, Facebook wants to know which Facebook page do you want to add this tab to go ahead and um, select hello friend which is a page that I created just a bogus page really and then we're going to go ahead and click the add page tab button and guess what we're done if we navigate now back to this page this hello friend page that I created by the way this is the URL that I um, where you can download the ebook um, and just to go over that really quickly picture of the ebook a download button first name and email that I will collect uh, as a lead that I can then utilize in the future so let's go ahead and navigate to this page and here we are on the hello friend page you'll notice over here under the more button that we have the free fasting ebook of course we want to manage these tabs and move the tab over so it's more in a prominent location we'll take this one and move it all the way next to the about save that and this moved our tab right next to the about tab making it far more prominent and we'll notice here in the sidebar that we have under our app section here get the ebook so either clicking this graphic the copy next to it or this tab will produce the same result in loading our form or page there we have it so we now have the secure content that we designed the graphic the form if I go ahead and enter some information here and email address and click the button will be redirected to guess what will be redirected to the download page for the free ebook the Daniel fast uh, by yours truly from the biblical cooking website so there you have it producing a tab creating a tab for your Facebook page and adding a graphic in the sidebar under the app section and utilizing secure content in this new tab section please feel free to go ahead and like the uh, video by clicking the like button feel free to share comment uh, and until next time God bless you and yours as you endeavor to bring glory to the risen king in your internet marketing endeavors. God bless.